But anyway, we've started here with a small container of flammable liquid uh, uh, that I have placed inside of a cylindrical screen. And then um, I have that cylindrical screen, screen on top of a record player here. So when we start it playing, you can see the flame grow into a spiral vortex there, or a pillar of fire here. Uh, and this is a result of what's known as the Coriolis effect. Uh, the turntable here would be similar to the earth rotating. Uh, the screen here uh, is to represent uh, gravity holding on to Earth's atmosphere. Uh, and because the atmosphere is a fluid, uh, it can uh, move around a little more freely. Uh, it ends up uh, creating cur air currents as the earth rotates underneath of it uh, that we don't notice, uh, that we wouldn't notice, say, with solid objects with here on land we're rotating along with the Earth, but the air doesn't quite have to move along with the Earth. It, it does follow it, uh, but it is fluid, so it has a little more flexibility there, if you will. And so then we end up uh, with something that's known as the Coriolis effect, creating uh, air currents and cycles that are, in the end, uh, the uh, major cause of, of wind uh, patterns that we notice here on Earth. Uh, and we can see the path or pattern of the air here inside of the uh, cylinder screen here um, by watching where the flame goes as it tries to follow uh, the oxygen and as the air gets moved and excites uh, and encourages the flame to burn faster.